from insane cliffs where you can dive off and kill yourself for fun, to shark infested waters where you're a meal. If you're stupid enough to try it as sport, USA will be there to show it as entertainment. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone and welcome to this special USA Up All Night presentation of the most cutting edge sport yet, extreme burlap bagging. Extremely thrilling because it's extremely illegal. And tonight's contestant is the fabulous Rhonda Shear from USA Up All Night. And she's extremely excited about this electrifying game. For those of you not familiar, these are the rules. Unsuspecting players are pulled from their cars, thrown into a burlap bag for no apparent reason, and left on a sidewalk. After that, it's anybody's guess. And now, down to the street for the player introductions. I don't want to do it! I don't want to go in the bag! I don't want Come on, come on, get in the bag! Get in the bag! Okay, just a minute, just a minute. Hi, I'm Rhonda Shear, USA, up all night. And tonight they want me to, uh... uh that you want me to do? Girl, I'm body bouncing. Now get in the bag. Hey, your players got 30 seconds. Get up here. Oh, no, no, please, please. Get up in the bag. Please, you got to get in the bag. Um, I'll give you a free t-shirt. There's a free t-shirt. Oh, you didn't tell me there was a free t-shirt. Maybe a leather jacket, too? Get him in the bag. Okay, okay, cool. All right. Tonight, we're going to have Doug Man in two movies. We're going to have Footloose and the Joy of Sex. And you'll be watching me doing some Extreme sport. Get in the bag. Get in the bag. What about my helmet? Oh, you you don't want to mess up your hair, do you? Okay, well then, um, get in the bag. All right, get in the bag. Get in the bag. Okay, get in the bag. I don't know okay. what you're going to do with these rookies. She's in the bag. Get in the bag. You start watching, Duck Man, and I'll show you. I'm going all the way. And we'll be back for the formal body toss and the national anthem right after this. You're watching USA Extreme Sports on the USA Television Network. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, here enjoying the traditional playing of the national anthem and awaiting the start of extreme body bagging, a sport that's a lot more acceptable now that they don't drag the bag behind a moving vehicle. And as Rhonda gets comfortable in her bag, an air of anticipation hangs in the air. So does the threat of prosecution if we get caught. And they say sports is only about ratings. Ha! We'll get back to the action right after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten at an undisclosed site in New York City. Here giving you the play-by-play. -play. And it appears that our newcomer to the sport of extreme body bagging, Rhonda Shear, is having her share of difficulties. And in a game that relies on skill, agility, and lots of calluses, it could be a long night for the contender. And sometimes the pictures speak for themselves. We'll be back with more right after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Let's go down to the street. This is important. I know this is a bad time, but when I have an autograph, I'm a huge fan. Hey pal, if you can get a pen through this hole, then you can have your autograph, okay? But if not, just stand back, because I'm working! Oh, yeah! Yeah, you know, 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 yeah, you know,
And now, back to more Up All Night. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, and that was the end of Duckman, which brings us back to extreme burlap bagging, and back to rookie Rhonda Shear. She's playing her guts out, and when you're in a bag, that can get quite messy. Now, down to the street. Can't you at least tell me what I'm supposed to do? I'm killing myself in here! And it's illegal touching. Okay, all right, wait, wait. Ah, that might be a And in the middle of the first period, Rhonda appears to be finally regaining her composure. Now, if she can just avoid another violent run-in with that hydrant, she just may get out of this game alive. More after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello, everyone. Shrugging off a few early bumps and bruises, hand scrapes, and one thing that may never heal properly, Rhonda Shear has proved herself a contender. Now, down to the streets. You're much better now. What's going on? Get the hell out of the bed. What is much better? I have something in my eye, but it's better now. What? And no. Come on. Come on. Step. No one calls that anymore. No one calls it. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hi, Wayne Tungsten here in New York City, where Rhonda Shear is currently still in a burlap bag. And although on the surface, this seems like a cruel sport, burlap bagging actually has many rules that keep it from attaining total barbarism. You just have to know what they are and what the referee looks for. Twaddling, a backwards motion accompanied by inadvertent body noises. Penalty, free kick from referee. Aberration. Similar to futzing, only louder. Penalty, free kick from the elderly. Unresponsive groping, self-explanatory. Penalty, poor self-esteem. Delusion, any exclamation denoting escape. Penalty, no escape. Offensive yanking, action is currently undefined, but the ref knows it when he sees it. Penalty, loss of position, often results in being placed in traffic. Combustion in the neutral zone, self-explanatory. Penalty, being in the bag with yourself. Fumfering, hitting a parked car with the head. Penalty, hitting a parked car with the head. Improper gravitation, self-explanatory. Penalty, free kick from referee. Unintentional discharge, anything left on the sidewalk after the player has been there. Penalty, embarrassment. We'll get back to the action after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the very first telecast of Extreme Burlap Bagging, starring Rhonda Shear. This is a game of inches, a game of strategy, and a game that carries a prison term of six to ten if the authorities find out. Well, you Come on. I swallowed a hair and I'm not moving till I cough it up. <laughs> Don't do that. Come on. Of course, my audience is going to have to put loose on USA up all night. 
You can tell Rhonda came to play. She also came to the street to window shop. Funny how a drunken crowd with a burlap bag can change things, isn't it? More after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, back again with more of USA Network's extreme burlap bagging. And the lovely and possibly bruised Rhonda Shear has been competing all night in this new extreme sport. Currently, she is ranked number seven in the world, though not as impressive when you consider that she's the only one to ever play this game. And while there's a break in the action here at Extreme Burlap Bagging, let's take a moment to mention to our viewers that if you're a fan of extreme sports and other events that don't guarantee happy endings, don't forget to stay tuned to USA for all your extreme sports fun. Coming up in future telecasts, face grinding from Las Vegas with many of your Hollywood favorites, shark hunting from Hawaii, you just never know who's on the menu next when many of your favorite stars from the world of sports announcing take the trip of a lifetime. Catharsis like you can't believe with the third annual Cattle Prod Festival from Houston, Texas. And of course, those fabulous, fabulous pit bulls. An all-star romp featuring some of your friends from the hit sitcom Three's Company. So while other networks are happy with balls and nets, stay with USA for all your sports needs. Because face it, sometimes regular TV just isn't enough. And we'll get back to burlap bagging after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, and we're coming up to the fourth period in Extreme Burlap Bagging. And it will be a revealing moment as we'll get our first look at Rhonda Shear since she started this grueling competition. Oh, this feels so good. All right, you got five more seconds. Five seconds, I just got out of here. And then maybe next time you'll train harder. Train harder for what? You get back. Yes, the good ones always make it look so easy, don't they? From somewhere in New York City, we'll be back with more USA Extreme Sports after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten with more Extreme Burlap Bagging, the most extreme sport of the 90s yet. This evening's celebrity competition features Rhonda Shear of USA up all night. Uh-oh, it looks like her trainer is going for the onside kick. Boy, this is gonna hurt. I just hope we can get in close. And still, we can't get approval from Amnesty International. You go figure. And at the end of the period, the score remains Rhonda in fourth place with a total score of 451. We'll be back to the action right after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hi, Wayne Tungsten here in New York City, where Rhonda Shear is currently still in a burlap bag and making television and sports history all at the same time. What a competitor! And although on the surface, this seems like a cruel sport, burlap bagging actually has many rules that keep it from attaining total barbarism. You just have to know what they are and what the referee looks for. Shunting, an illegal maneuver involving the lips. Penalty, three points. Inner thigh rule. Rule used to protect player from self-abuse, usually called in conjunction with illegal touching. Any action involving skin, penalty, 14 points. Illegal motion, any forward movement that occurs against your body's will, penalty, loss of previous points. Encroachment, getting too close to oneself in a suspicious way, penalty, one point. Three second violation, play stoppage for any reason that's not medical, penalty, placement on hot pavement, seizure, Self-explanatory, no penalty assessed. Lingering, same as dawdling. Penalty, free kick from referee. Illegal use of body. 
self-explanatory penalty free kick from referee futzing to futz in an unappealing way penalty free kick from referee we'll get back to the action after this this is USA extreme sports Hi, Wayne Tungsten here with more of USA's extreme burlap bagging. Let's go down to the street. In the bag, Rhonda Shear. Why? Wrong place, wrong time. Oh, and with that conversion, she just scored right there. She's eligible for the jumper cables. Oh, a rare and gutsy call for a rare and gutsy lady. That's why some call it a game you can't beat with a stick. Well, you can, but you just won't see it in televised play. More of extreme burlap bagging after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, and tonight, Extreme Burlap Bagging, starring Rhonda Shear. A game not as popular as, say, the body luge, but a sport that really gets the blood pumping, and spurting, and dripping, and that spells ratings. Now, down to the street. Okay, okay, I'm moving, I'm moving. You go back to footloose on USA, up all night. Oh, trainer! How am I doing, trainer? Oh, yeah, yeah, very good, oh, yeah. Oh, and that lingering penalty is going to cost Rhonda dearly. According to the rules, two more, and the bag gets moved down to one of New York's many subway platforms. Pray it doesn't come to that. From Sports Central, I'm Wayne Tungsten. This is USA Extreme Sports. Rhonda Shear, a game gal involved in a game she doesn't understand. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, here with more of USA's Extreme Burlap Bagging. A sport so new that our contestant Rhonda Shear is our first and only athlete to actually try the sport out. Of course, with a new sport comes a whole new set of rules and regulations, most of them made up on the spot. And in the middle of the first period, with a score of 23 over 14, Rhonda appears to be finally regaining her composure. More after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, and back to Extreme Burlap Bagging, and back to rookie Rhonda Shear, a game gal involved in a game she doesn't understand. Now, down to the street. I'm not playing anymore. And now, the conclusion of Footloose on USA Up All Night. Ah, crabbiness, a cagey strategy indeed. But I don't think the league is going to sanction this move. In fact, they may assess a free mallet penalty, just like they did to Beatrice Arthur back in the 78 championships. And that's something I know we can't televise. More after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. And that was the end of Footloose. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, and in tonight's second half, we'll be showing the joy of sex. And what a joy we have here tonight, as we mere mortals watch Rhonda Shear set some sort of record in a very exciting new sport, extreme burlap bagging. Now to the streets for an update. No, this is the last bit! 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 No
He's in a bed. No, take him in Santa. Oh, get up, young man. Oh, that's who you should kill. You're a bad man. Hi, everyone. This year, USA, I'm going to And if that's not the face of a true competitor we're seeing, then, well, that's her bag. And with the score tied at 15 once again, we'll be back after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten here at the very first extreme sport to be televised as if it was legal, extreme burlap bagging. And in the bag, Rhonda Shear, a novice just a couple of hours ago, she's now showing the veteran skills of a player who knows how to win and how to clot. Now to the streets. So much longer. So much longer. Oh, don't worry. There's uh, plenty of time left. No! Listen to the spirit in that lady. Listen for the lawsuit in the making. We now return to the joy of sex, but we'll bring you live updates, or tragically injured ones, as they come in. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, here with more of USA's Extreme Burlap Bagging, a sport so new that our contestant Rhonda Shear is our first and only athlete to actually try the sport out. And out on the field, it appears that we have a difference of opinion. Let's listen in. You take the through way, you see, it's more cold, but it's more direct. <laughs> No, no, I think I take the Sawmill River Parkway. That'll get you there just as quick. Hey, come on, what's going on out there? Am I done? No! Okay. <laughs> Hi, I'm Rhonda Share USA up all night, and we now get back to the joy of sex. I think I'm getting the hang of it. And if she thinks she's getting the hang of it now, wait till later when we turn the cameras off. More from the Sports Center after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. Hello everyone, I'm Wayne Tungsten, back again with more of USA Network's Extreme Burlap Bagging. Now, down to the street. You're in the home stretch, come on now! Come on, I'm out of fire! Stretch, stretch! Now, I don't know how much longer I can do it. I, I broke a nail and I think I might have lost an ear and down my ear. And after three, the score for Rhonda is now 122 over three. How fast they learn. This is USA Extreme Sports. Wayne Tungsten here with more of USA's extreme burlap bagging. And despite the lack of air, Rhonda continues to show why she'll make it to this year's Olympic team, whether she intends to or not. I'm not playing. I have a purr. And now the conclusion of the joy of sex on USA up all night. What the hell is a purr? And to think this is a sport that was at one time only played by farmers with a vermin problem. It's amazing to see how far we've come in such a short time. More after this. This is USA Extreme Sports. and Hollywood hot tubs. Until then... Hey guys! Actually, I'm feeling really good. 
feel glowing. My complexion feels really good, and all that time this bag really toned my body. I'm going back in. Bye-bye. I'm such a jock. I bet I won first place. Is there an Olympic burlap bag bouncing competition? I know I can win. Come on, guys. Come on. Bounce me around again. <laughs>